all right youtube it's your boys Yuxus, and uh today we're going to be going over these jp patch notes now usually i don't go over the jp patch notes um but i was excited for this one well i wasn't really excited for this one i was because i thought it was going to be assault but it's not it's actually liz uh pink red hair liz so um let's go over it so we have liz right um do i click this yeah there we go it's been a long time so we have the new Liz um, she's a Christmas unit on her banner you got blue Ellie Hawk you got green Liz you got blue Liz um, you get Vaughn I think this is red hell or red king green tank Deanne this is a fat king this is red Hellbrum. I don't remember this is a Hellbrum. and then who are these units holy night Ooh. Hold on, who are those units? My bad, y'all. I I don't know who those units are. I'm thinking it's Deldre and uh, yeah. Okay, so yeah, they just messed it up. It's Deldre and Death Pierce. Um, but this girl is actually pre. She's not good in um PVP, but she's actually God tier for um crimson or not crimson for gray demon right and she's actually god tier um and it's not even what she does it's what her passive is so let me pull it up actually because they put it here on grand cross database on twitter um it's it's so godly what she does or in terms of her passive like she doesn't even do it do anything basically she ranks up the skill cards of all allies at the start of the turn in death match if allies are all HP attributes applies when ent entering battle limit once which means in gray hell because you're forced to use all green units you're going to rank up all your cards which means if you have green gold throw with this guy or with this guy <laughs> with this girl and then you your ally like your partner has green gold as well you will get ranked three cards turn one because she will rank up green gold card all right let me let me pull up green gold green gold she will rank up Green Gulter, which means he will get a level 2, which means he will increase all allies. And then the other Green Gulter on um, your friend's team or whatever team will rank up all allies. So you will have rank 3 skills, all rank 3 skills turn 1. Pretty god tier. Uh, in terms of that, for only that. Oh, she, they put her as a goddess. Now that's pretty cool. Because this is supposed to be human Liz, but they put her as a goddess just because of the backstory with Liz. That's pretty cool. I actually like that. Um, I, I I really like that. She's that's pretty cool. Cause this if you, this is a human Liz. This is not the goddess Liz. This is a human Liz. But because of because this is Liz and her backstory, if y'all know what it is, then you would understand why they put her as a goddess, which is pretty cool to me. I, I kind of like that. Um, she inflicts damage to 500% of an attack on one enemy, fills ultimate move gauge by two orbs, same thing as Escanor. Um, and then her second skill, inflicts damage equal to 400% of an attack on one enemy, decreases rank sk or skill ranks, and then depletes the ultimate move gauge by the number of rank skills decrease. So it's like red bonds, practically. Um, and then she has inflicts shattering, shatter damage equal to 630% of an attack on one enemy, which shatter ignores resistance so she's pretty cool um this is like her art uh i kind of like this not even gonna lie um i really like i really like this yeah i really like this um and then stuff like that right uh let's go back we also have the new the one christmas selfie coming out so i don't know what this means because if you guys don't know, there was a leak saying there was a do rag Eskimo coming out, which means they already have two festival Eskimo outfits ready. There was nothing in the leak saying a Christmas the one Eskimo was gonna come out um, in terms of outfits. So I'm picking this up when it comes out for gems. You know me. Um, I'm gonna pick it all of it up just for the outfit because I don't really need a UR outfit because i already maxed out all my ur outfits but i'm gonna pick it up just because i like it a lot um and it, it's a custom image like I, I want that i want a custom image for my uh Eskimer. then we have the glocks melascular this one's looking really nice oh i'm gonna like this 
Uh, Monspeed looks drippy, and then Gallon looks like he needs pants. But yeah, you have these cool um, Christmas outfits coming back. These are actually old; they're not new. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, Monspeed looks like it's so cool. His, his is drippy. Um, so there's that. You got whatever this is. Hold a special Christmas party event. Okay. So it shows Elaine here. I don't know why, but. Oh, so okay, it's one of those things where you complete missions and then you get her SSR outfits. These, yeah, these are her SSR outfits. And what? Oh. So you're going to be able to craft something. These are Christmas decorations, but what are they used for? Are these like foods? I doubt it, because these are SSR foods, which means these would be the first SSR foods. So, I doubt they're foods, but we'll see. And then, yeah, you get Liz's outfit. You get some pretty godass rewards. Like, you get some good-ass rewards here. Not even gonna cap. Um, and then, yeah, the, this stuff. So, what I'm thinking is, the thing about this that I didn't mention is that it says you get her on step five. Right, where does it say? Can I see the part where it says that? It doesn't say it anywhere here. Like, in English. Okay, no. I don't know what, what it means. Because it says here, step is from 1 to 10. When step 10 is achieved, they'll reset from step 1. Which is weird because it says right here, step 5 SSR character. Like, it just says step 5. So I assume, I don't know. But over here it says step 10. So I don't know what step 5 is. Oh, step 5 is a guaranteed SSR. That's what that means. And then here it's step 10. Then you get her. Makes sense. Okay. So, she's not a free unit, um, because they don't say anything about giving tickets. Because I was thinking if she was a free unit, maybe they would bring Assault Mode, but who knows. They could still bring him out, um, they will bring him out soon, trust me, right? They will bring him out soon, regardless, because he's coming with Chapter 16.5. They will not wait as long as people want them to wait. Um, like, some people want them to wait, like, a couple of months, like, four or three months, just so that he's a festival unit, but they're not gonna wait that long to drop out Chapter 16.5. Um, that'd just be ridiculous. Um, so Liz is also getting UR gear and stuff like that. Pretty cool. Um, do, am I excited? Not really. I mean, I'm excited for this outfit. Um, do I care about this Liz? Not really. Just because I don't have Green Gulker, so this is useless to me. Um... But, they don't see anywhere where if she's free or not. Like, that's the only thing. They don't say if she's free or if she's not. But. Oh. Oh, okay. This is cool. They, if you guys did not get him, they added Green Arthur to the Humans, Giant, and Oak. So, Green Arthur is going to be like, um... Oh, okay, so he's gonna be like Ludocha and Sarda. They will probably have a part three ticket somewhere in the future and then put all these units that are only on these race draws on that banner. So Ludo, Sariel, Tarmiel, Arthur, just stuff like that. Maybe Nanashi when he comes out, most likely. But yeah, uh, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm out. Peace.